Hello friends, welcome to this video and today we are going to see what all of us need to do at the beginning of our data analysis. We summarize the data to describe it. We calculate mean, median, standard deviation, variance, standard error, range, interquartile range, minimum value, maximum value and so on. It's time consuming to do that for n number of variables one by one. And that laborious, repetitive task many of us do very patiently and passionately in spite of having a power tool like our programming at hand. Let's do that. Here we are going to use dataset iris. Therefore, let's know about dataset iris. Head function is very useful to see first six row and there we will understand about variables, a type of variables and here four numeric variables are there and one categorical variable is there and mean, mode, median. We cannot calculate for the categorical variable. We have to keep that in mind. Structure also tell us more about the data set and that str iris will run and here 150 observations of five variables are there. And those five variables, four are numeric variables and the species variable is a factor. It has level setosa versicular and other third level. We will start calculating manually mean for sepal dot length. That is the first variable that S shall be capital and we'll run that. And sepal dot length not found. We have to use that iris scalar and that mean is there now we can use the same thing to calculate mean for all others that petal dot length okay then we can have sepal dot width mean also sepal dot width mean is there and we can have mean for petal dot width also but this is very laborious thing calculating mean manually and uh, if we have r then we can calculate using programmatic using programming way and for that we'll use the s apply function and s apply function gets applied to all the variables which are there and here the data set we are going to use is iris the first argument is the object that is iris now second argument is function and that function is here we are going to use mean and that na dot rm is equal to true shall be used if na values are there and you will not have error and it is saying that for first four numeric variables it has calculated mean but for the species variable it couldn't calculate mean and it is saying that argument is not numeric therefore we will remove the fifth variable and for that we will use indexing Okay, in indexing, normal structure is R, comma, columns. Row is the first one and separated by, by comma, the columns. And we require all rows in the data, but we don't require the fifth column. Therefore, we will remove the fifth column using the minus sign and that fifth column from the data. And we'll see that data I selected and I will run that. And now you can see here that the fifth column is not there. That species column is not there. And this species is not there. We'll deselect that and we'll run the line. And here you can see that all the four means have been calculated in just one click. Now the same thing I will copy to save time of typing. And we'll go there. And we'll use it for calculating medians. And for all medians are there will use that for calculating standard deviation and that standard deviation is there we can use that for range also any function you can keep there and that function will be applied to all the rows sorry all the columns all the variables of that uh, data set and it can be applied to rows also there is a slight change in the code and that uh, we have calculated minimum that when we calculated for range minimum and maximum both have been uh, provided and when we calculated only for mean only minimum values have been provided and that same thing we can use for max also max value can be obtained this is about programming way and for standard error that is uh, 
very useful thing standard error function is not available in base r but that is available in plot tricks and for that i will call the library plot tricks and you need to install the plot tricks package if you don't have inst it installed then go to tools install packages and type the name plot tricks there select that click install it will get installed and when it gets installed run the library plot tricks now plot tricks functions are there now again we are going to use that s apply and instead of this function mean we'll add their function standard dot error and we'll run that all standard errors have been calculated this is the way how we calculate descriptive statistics again this is not uh, that e uh, fast way it's a laborious way for each one we have to do that and there are many packages which provide special functions to calculate all those just in a single line of code functions are there to do that base r function summary which we are very familiar with also gives the five point summary and we'll see that for iris and that summary is there separate length minimum value first quantile median mean third quantile max value has been given for numeric variables for all numeric variables those values are there and for spaces it has provided us counts for setosa 50 versicolor 50 and virginica 50 package hmisc provide still elegant function hmisc i am calling the library if you have not installed the package hmisc install that through install packages when we call the library those functions will be available to us and those required dependencies are getting loaded now the function for us to compute summary statistics is describe and this describe function takes the argument first argument is data set and that's it very easy to use uh, i will just increase the size of this console and you can see that Five variables are there 150 observations are there and for sample length uh, number is provided zero missing values are there 35 distinct values are there and 15 values are some repetitions uh, information content is 0 0.998 mean value 5.843 gmd is there 0 0.9462 0 0.05 quartile 0 0.1 quartile 0 0.25 quartile and those quartiles have been given and lowest first five values are provided and for highest highest values first five values are provided okay. and that's been done for all the numeric variables for categorical variable it has provided the count and value for setosa that frequency is 50 for versicular frequency is 50 for virginica frequency is 50 and proportion in total data is 0 0.33 and it's very useful get all the summary statistics in one line of code and for the next function we use the package pass tech load the library PASTAC and if you have not installed this past text package go to tools install packages and install that and when you get installed run the library and the function required is stat.desc the argument first argument is the data set and that's it we'll run that and we'll increase the console size to see the results and this also we don't require we'll minimize that and we'll see here that for all the variables uh, the statistics summary statistics has been calculated this is number value 150 values are there and here null values uh, no null value is there in the variables then na values again na values are not there minimum maximum range sum sum of total uh, values in that variable median mean standard error to mean confidence interval to mean uh, variance a standard dot deviation and coefficient of variance all have been calculated for us very useful function and this function comes from package pass text we will restore the script window and the next function is coming from package and the next function is coming from package psych we'll call the library psych and if you have not installed that again go to tools menu install packages and install the package psych i have installed that i will call the library and that psych library is there now we have to remember here that the function is described the same function was there in uh, that 
library HMISC also. Therefore, to differentiate, we will use the package name and this colon and again colon. That psych function describe and in bracket the data set name and we'll run that and it has been calculated. We'll again increase the console window and you can see that uh, slightly abridged version but all for all one for all variables summary statistics have been calculated where that variables 1 2 3 4 5 n values 150 150 values are there in each and uh, mean for all standard deviation for all median trimmed mean that mean absolute deviation and minimum maximum range skew kurtosis and standard error all have been calculated just in one line of code let's restore the console and our script window to go to another function and that another function is also coming from library psych and that is describe by function in bracket the argument iris and here it takes the formula interface and along with that we will type the spaces so that we will get summary statistics for the spaces also and we will run that and it has been calculated again we will use the console size and we will see that descriptive statistics by group that describe by function gives us descriptive statistics by group and that group we can use using the spaces and uh, if we have another grouping variable then we can add the plus there and another grouping variable will be added after that plus spaces plus another grouping variable and here we have got that for spaces setosa all the summary statistics for spaces versicular all the summary statistics and for virginica all the summary statistics and that's all for uh, using r to calculate summary statistics thank you for watching this video if you have liked this video please click the like button subscribe to my channel if you are not subscribed it yet Share this video with your friends and if you want notifications of my new videos, please click the bell icon. Thank you.